Well, best of luck to our next two guests, because following the footsteps of Elton John, David Furnish, and last year became proud parents to baby Zachary, H from Steps, Ian Watkins, and his boyfriend Craig have set their hearts on using a surrogate to become parents as well. And uh, here they are to talk about it. And how, how does it all work? Um. <laughs> Well, I don't mean well, the, I don't, make the, a I don't mean clinically. <laughs> I just mean the the process. He's very naive. Ian. <laughs> well, I mean, there's different kind of processes, but um, we've opted for uh, a, an egg donor and uh, a surrogate. So that's the route that we're going down. And um, we've chosen our egg donor, and we're just about to choose our surrogate, aren't we? Yeah. So a you have, just, have you decided? which one of you will be biological daddy? Then? Well, we've decided, yes. but we're actually not going to tell anybody... Why? Do you know, because, just for example, if uh, Craig was to father our child, or children, yes. then I don't want my friends or family to treat that child any differently. I don't, I'm not saying that they would. Look, yeah. look, when the wee thing comes out wearing glasses, <laughs> we, know, we know where it's come from. It's got curly hair, so you, we'll all know. <laughs> or a we'll microphone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's the reason, yeah. really. Just you know, just so everybody treats them equal. And what about you know, ad adoption? Did you consider that as an option, or is this was surrogacy your first choice? No, we did consider adoption. Yeah. Um, we were quite I far mean, into the process, actually. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. After after we'd been together for about six months, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. We talked about mm -hmm. um, the adoption process because we thought that was the only the only kind of thing available to mm. us, really. Um, and we did about a year and a half, wasn't it? Yeah. And it was a really it wasn't for us, I mean, for many people, I'm sure it is a positive experience, but for us, um, it didn't uh, really confirm that that was the route for us. Yeah, yeah and did they, do they give you, is it quite a hard process, the adoption thing? I mean, is one of these routes harder than the other? Oh, yeah, I mean, it's a hard process, and rightly so, mm. you know. I think you're, you're supported, you know, you're very much supported along the process. Are you, do they ask questions, I mean, b because you're same-sex partners and whatever, would it, would it be more difficult for you than... Uh, Partners not of at all. Sex. No, there's no, no discrimination no. whatsoever. Not at all. Um, I, I felt like we were supported. We were in a group of about 16 people um, who were, you know, having the training, so to speak. And they were single parents, mm. gay couples. You know, th there was a mixture of all different types of people. Absolutely. And how uh, did you have a kind of criteria when you when you chose your surrogate mum? Um, well, did you I mean, know what type of person you wanted, different uh, type of look? Or I think the most important thing for us was the health, mm. you know, to have good health. And you can trace um, an egg donor's family, you know, if there's any kind of cancer or any kind of, you know, um, heart disease within the family. So to eradicate that, then, you know, for our child mm. to be healthy, that's what we so wanted. So what stage are you at now? Has this lady said yes, she's going to do it? The egg donor has said yes, yes, which is great, which is scary and exciting. Mm. Um, and we're just about to confirm our surrogate. Okay. So we're off to LA next week to kind of meet so her it and yeah, it's all happening. Exciting. So how are, you, how are you thinking, you know, what do you think fatherhood will be like? What kind of dads do you think you will make? Do you want some there are lots of books. <laughs> 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 yeah. Have you written a book? Please. <laughs> I mean, we've got, you know, friends and family that have kids. So, you know, we have a fantastic network around us. And it is a lovely thing, wait. but it will change your lives forever, of mm. course, and it will make you realise just how selfish you have been Absolutely. up until yeah. now, because Absolutely. you can't be selfish anymore. Well, we know? watch our friends now, you know, a lot of friends our age have kids, and we just see that they're not able to go and do, you know, certain yeah. holidays that we've all been a part of before. Mm -hmm. But then we've kind of changed the pattern of holiday now, so we go and stay in a big barn together and they bring the kids. The thing is, you know, at a certain age, you've done all that anyway. Yeah. It's yeah. just, you know, you can't do things as spontaneously. What about your families? What do they think? Oh, they can't wait. This? My mother, I mean, it'll be my mum's first grandchild, so she's beside herself. She's mm -hmm. knitting already. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, just for this to be, you know, uh, for people to be aware of this process, you know, we just thought ad adoption would be the route mm -hmm. but we've been helped massively by the British Surrogacy Centre I mean I mean they've just mm. been incredible they mm. have oh. is it still as controversial as it would be 10 years ago or so because particularly with you two being same sex you know the mm. accusation is going to be ah oh, but for them this will only be a designer accessory that's mm. why they've, they've gone down the street do, do you find much controversy or you find so a lot far, of good with this not really I mean we're up in North Wales you know, and we've had everybody giving support, us, you yeah. know, massive positive support and they're just so chuffed for us. And, and we, for us, we're doing this for the right reasons. There are so many children out there that are born out of love, but, mm -hmm. you know, we're doing it for the right reasons. You know, we want are to... Are you going through your name books and things? Yeah. Yes. Yes. We want Welsh names. Yes. Oh, so got any on the list yet? Yeah, kind of, but because we don't know what mm -hmm. Mother Nature is going to mm -hmm. decide, then, you know... Well, come back and see us. And yes. let us know when yeah. it's all happening or bring the baby with you. Yeah. We wish or you babies. We wish all babies, oh, yes. Scary. Could be more than one, yeah. absolutely. <laughs>
Craig Yates, thank you very much. Thank Good you. luck. Thank you. Nice talking to you.